Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel and in this video we are going to create a movie poster in Canva. So we will use all the tools we have learned so far in the practical application of a project that is a movie poster. So if you want to learn the complete Canva and this is the first video you are watching on our channel, we have a complete playlist that you can check out from the description and without wasting any time, let's get started with this video. One way of getting creative with uh, Canva as well is uh, creating a poster like this. As you notice that this is a, a poster of a, let's say, movie or a magazine. And it's a warrior showing here on the mountain and with the scene in the background, the birds. But all of these elements are separately added in the scene. The text, the character, the hill and the photo. So how can we create such an image or a poster from scratch? Let's see. I'll first go to main screen and write poster here. It says movie poster. So create a blank movie poster. And it totally depends on your thinking how you create that. But let me uh, just show you some of the tools that you can use for that. Uh, now, for example, if I want to create the same scene, I'll uh, choose a mountain first or a hill so let's go to the photos and right here hill so take any image you want or you think is suitable so that you can make the warrior stand on that hill so just scroll down until you find your relevant image for example this one now let's fit all of this to the complete area even make you can make it larger so that you ca it can fit your scene now I don't want it to be a daytime scene I want it to be a nighttime scene so what I'll do is I'll remove the background I'll click on edit image and remove the background now again, if you are using the educational version or the pro version, you will be able to use this tool. Now click apply. For the night time, these mountains are too bright, right? So what I'll do after that is, I'll go to edit image and use the adjust functions for it. I'll reduce the brightness and you can increase the contrast. And you can use the saturation points as well to adjust it to the night time. Let's say we are creating an evening time, right? So this might work. Okay, let's test this. So this is my mountain. I have adjusted the brightness and contrast a little bit. You need to play around it. Now let's find a perfect sunset image. I'll click on sunset here and click on photos. You can use any image that you find suitable for the particular scene. Okay, I need to see this option bring to forward or bring to um, backward, uh, but I need to detach image from the background for this hill um, image so that both image on the page can adjust to the scene. Okay, so this is my poster. You can set it anywhere you want as you see fit for the image. So this is kind of it. And now let's see, I wanna bring it little down. Let's see over here and the other clip as well okay so this is my image now i want a warrior to stand up right here so i'll search for warrior and click on photos to find one i can f uh, use any warrior image you want from here let's say 
let's use the exact one which was uh, this one so let's remove the background from here as well I'll go to edit image and click on background remover and it removed the background now if you want to adjust it you find it uh, is not suitable for the scene you want to make it dark I, I can go to adjust and increase or decrease the brightness and the contrast but it seems suitable so I'll use this one as uh, it is just zoom it a little bit see if it fits the foot or you can send it to back or you can bring this mountain to the front so that you don't see the feet select the mountain and bring front so this is how now it's standing over the mountains looks like this so that's perfect now I want to use some birds as well so let's write birds here for example these ones okay these ones are pretty perfect for the scene you can tilt it if you want like this and if I want to highlight this warrior let's say in the sunset so how can I do that I'll used uh, something like Sun and in the graphics let's find it what is suitable so this is my image but I'll adjust that in a particular way I'll adjust that over here on the warrior but I'll use it as a highlighter so what I'll do is I'll increase I'll reduce the transparency first and then I'll go to edit image adjust and click on blur increase the blur and basically what I'll do is bring it forward bring the warrior forward and just select this send to backward like this okay now move the mountain up so it looks something like this pretty nice if you want to blend it more you can uh, reduce the transparency even more okay so now if I want to add a text I'll add a heading like this and write the warrior and adjust it on the frame like this and I'll bring it downward now I want this text to go through this uh, person let's write the warrior only the wa warrior only so let's do like this I want this eye to go through this image so let's make sure that you have selected the image there are multiple images involved now that's why you are unable to select that particular image and to backwards so it's showing like this perfect and then you can move your mountain up so this is the complete look this is how you can make your own poster in Canva this is just one example uh, of how you can uh, get creative with all the tools that we have learned so far the point of showing you all this uh, poster is as you can see that we have included each scene separately to create a complete poster from scratch so this is how you can use this inspiration and use it all, uh, in your creative way uh, for your particular scenario uh, just practice it by yourself I recommend you uh, to come up with your own idea or even reproduce this idea so that you can grasp what I have explained in this video and then we will move to the next one so that's it I hope you liked the video and if you did hit the like button, subscribe to our channel and turn on the notification bell so that you can get notified of all the future videos. This is Saad signing off from today's video. Take care. Uh -huh.